After 24 consecutive weeks of murders and suicides, Los Angeles remains within a dark cloud and waiting for the next series of horrific events to unfold. Unfortunately, Monday evening, week 25 has begun, and the latest victim was found at his home in West Hollywood. The killer is still out there. Los Angeles remains under a blanket of mystery for the 25th consecutive week. Authorities haven't found a single suspect. Now with a new victim found Monday, all we can do is wait until the killer's body surfaces. The LAPD and FBI have created a special detective division dedicated to solving these series of deaths without society. This string of murders has caused mass chaos around the city of LA. Local businesses have seen a drop in their afternoon evening clientele. I can't blame them for wanting to stay off the streets. I hate this waiting. Where's it gonna be? Believe me, Stone, there's about a million places I would rather be today instead of pent up here waiting for another cold corpse to show up. It's been half a year of this crap, man. Nobody in this office has a line on anything. We got nothing to go on at all. Still waiting on a line from that spam number, though. It could be something. That's yeah, a reach. It's probably calling everybody in the county. The tech's still working on it. We should hear something today at some point. The sad thing is we both know what's coming. Somebody's gotta find the body, but it's already out there. Somewhere. All right. Murder happened at Monday at 11, forensics is saying, so. Killer always commits suicide within 24 hours. Guys, guys, we've got something crazy going on with that spam caller. What'd you find? It appears to be an automated system based on our records, but it's a little bit strange because it came from a cellular line. The calls are going out every 15 minutes, give or take. We even tried calling the number, but all we got was heavy breathing, and then they just hang up. We can't trace it when we dial, it's too short, but with the frequency of the outgoing calls on a daily basis, we should be able to track the signal if the calls are still happening. Maybe triangulate? If it's a cell, it could be on the move. You guys, this could be something. How much longer until you have this? Yeah, Brody's downstairs working on it now, so hopefully really soon. Okay, we've got to get a trace on this line. This could be our only lead. Stone. Downtown? Got it. Yeah, no, we're on our way. They found the killer, or <laughs> suicider? Yeah. Female, mid-20s, looks like she jumped. Wallace, we gotta get down there. Forensics is already on their way. Emily? Yes, John. Call me the second you have something.
Well, what do you got for us, Sam? Hey, Stone. We've got a Vic. Eliza Gloms, 25. We grabbed the name from her wallet. It appears that she took a dive from the roof and landed back here. Looks like she hit one of the containers on the way down. Not the best dive. Anything out of the ordinary? We just got here. We've only had time for the sweep. I was uh, about to tuck in and look at the body a bit closer. I want that phone tested to see if it turns on. I want to know who she last spoke with. This is strange. The detectives? There's something on her neck behind this bandage. What the hell is that? I don't know. I've never seen anything like that, really. Yeah, stone here. Nimix. Where? Yeah. Yeah, got it. Yeah, no, we'll be right down. We're already close. What's up? That was tech. He traced the cell phone line to a Peter Nimix downtown. Get this. All the calls he's made in the last few hours come from the same warehouse. It's been closed for months. What do you say we go take a look? Let me see some hands. Help me. Detective, it is so good to finally see you. <laughs> Wallace, get in here. Oh, oh, that's okay, Detective. This is really just between you and me. 
you have been so thorough in following the crumb that led you here. I'm impressed. Of course, I will have to work harder. Stand up. Slowly. Put your hands on your head. Whatever you say, detective. You know, you're really just postponing the schedule. We can certainly find ways to catch up. These murders, these deaths, it stops today. Is it today, detective? No, no, that, that, that's not the schedule. My work's not even close to being done. Very sorry to hear that, but uh, maybe you can do this schedule from behind bars because we've got you. Got me? Got me? Oh, you've got me. <sighs> Detective, I really hoped you'd know more. That you've only found the dispatcher, not the caller. This is merely an operator doing what I need him to do. You're done here, Nemix. Nothing's done, detective. I'm happy you found the bandage. I'm real happy. But you didn't even find what I put in the blood. Hell, you're not even asking about the calls. You think you've uncovered something? You barely even dusted off the tarp. It's time to disconnect, Detective. You were close. But I've got to get back to work. So much to do. Well, let's call it in. Get an ambulance in here now. Call it in. Get an ambulance. It's been a great time. As I said, there's just so much to do, and the schedule must be attended to. <laughs> 